Jodie Hayward and I am the Animal Home Manager at Bristol Animal Rescue Centre. Banksy's been with us now about five months. Um, previous to him coming into us, uh, he's had multiple homes and we just feel that he doesn't really know where he belongs or who he is, uh, hence the name Banksy, which we think suits him very well. Um, he is looking for a home at the moment and we feel that he'd be better suited to an adult only home. Uh, he's, he's a lively boy uh, who absolutely loves his training um, and doing all sorts of fun games um, and he absolutely loves his enrichment. Uh, you can see here he's progressing very well with his training with the staff. You ready? Yeah. Oh, there you go. Good boy, thank you. So the uh, painting is something that we've done previously with the dogs here at Bristol Animal Rescue Centre. We held a Facebook auction uh, last year um, and allowed all of our various animals that we have on site to do some paintings. And we actually felt where Banksy loves working for food that he would be a really good candidate to do some painting with. When we matched up everything with regards to his name, who Banksy is, uh, we thought he would be absolutely great to be able to do some of the original Banksy paintings in his own version. <laughs> he loves it, he loves doing things for food um, and the way that we do it enables him to work alongside his carer uh, on a one-on-one -on -one, which is really positive uh, for any animals in a rescue centre. It allows him time out of his kennel and it's an absolute great enrichment. <laughs> completed two of his uh, Banksy artworks so far and we look forward to putting those out to auction uh, in the new year. Um, we feel, you know, we may be biased but we feel he's done a very good job. Um, he's visited one of the Banksy artworks around Bristol and we hope as long as he's happy to that we will get him out to visit some more. Uh, Banksy also has help from his humans uh, to kind of do the planning and the design uh, and then we let him loose with the, uh, the paints. Uh, his humans decide on which colours he, he should be using on a certain paint um, and then we're able to kind of add the colours onto the, to the boards uh, and allow him to work his magic after that. Oh, good boy. <laughs> well done. Don't break it though. Yeah, we would uh, highly recommend somebody who's had experience of possibly a rescue dog before, um, of his kind of breed type, which is sort of the bull breed, um, bull breed cross. <laughs> Almost. Ready? Huh? <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> Not quite. Huh? Playing um, and being able to understand that he doesn't really know where he belongs at the moment, so a lot of security. We would encourage it to be a, an adult-only home, um, as I say, with the experience of that type of breed. Namaste.